All right, so we just went over solving area problems with parallelograms as well as rectangles. So now we're going to try some triangles. So for a triangle, we have to remember that we have to use our formula, area equals base times height. <clears throat> All right, there we go. So area is e going to be equal to the base times the height divided by two for triangles. So um, a boat has a triangle in the sh uh, has a sail in the shape of a triangle. So it could look something like this. Uh, the sail has an area of 12 yards squared. So total area is going to be equal to 12 yards squared. And then we know for sure that that the base of the sail is going to be three yards. So what we're trying to figure out right now is our height. Okay. So let me just go ahead and write the formula again. Area is equal to base times height divided by two. Or um, some people use half of the base times height. It's the same thing. We know for sure that the area is 12 yards. Um, we know for sure that the base is equal to three. We don't know what the height is, so we're going to keep that as h. Okay. And then we have to, of course, divide by two. Now, I need to get to this h over here. So this divide by 2 is in the way. So the opposite of dividing by 2 is to multiply by 2. Since this is algebra, of course I have to do it to both sides. So this way I have 3h freed up and then 3h is going to be equal to 24. Now I'm just going to go ahead and divide by 3 on each side. Divide by 3. So in this situation h is going to be equal to 8 yards. Right? My height will be equal to 8 yards. Okay, so let's go ahead and try our second example. A garden is in the shape of a right triangle. So let me just go ahead and draw that. This is going to be my right triangle. The height of the garden is 9 meters. So 9 meters is going to be our height from here to here. If the area of the garden is 22.5 meters squared, what is the base of the garden? So it's this thing down here that we're trying to figure out. I know for sure that the area is equal to the base times the height divided by 2. I know that, th that the area is 22.5 and I know for sure that the height is 9. I just don't know the base. Okay, So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to multiply by 2 in order to, to get to that B. So multiply by 2 on this side and multiply by 2 on this side. So 22.5 multiplied by 2 is going to be equal to 45. Then we have 9b. So I'm going to go ahead and divide by 9 here and divide by 9 here. So my b value is going to be equal to 9, um, to 9, who is going to be equal to 5 meters. b value is equal to 5 meters. 